Google launched the Accelerated Mobile Pages project back in 2015, and ever since, it has been both praised and criticized by people across the internet. This video isn't to debate that topic, instead it's to demonstrate a new feature that is built into the Brave browser application, and then I would like to show you how to disable it if you so choose. Now the folks behind the Brave browser have announced a new update to both the beta and nightly builds of their privacy web browser. The feature is being referred to as DAMP, and its goal is to redirect the browser application to the full version of the website automatically instead of needing to visit the AMP version of the website first and then hoping the developers made it easy to switch over to the full version. Now I know millions of people have installed tools like browser extensions that have allowed them to bypass AMP versions of websites, and now a similar feature is being built directly into Brave Browser. So as mentioned, Right now, this feature is only available in the beta and nightly builds of the app, but we are expecting this to land in the stable build in the near future. This feature has been enabled by default, so if you prefer to avoid AMP versions of websites, then you won't need to do anything. However, those who want to turn this feature off will need to open up the application, dive into the settings area, look in this first features section so that you can tap the Brave Shields and Privacy option. And right toward the top you should see an, a new feature, a new toggle here, labeled Auto Redirect AMP Pages. And as mentioned, this feature is going to be enabled by default, at least that is how they are introducing this feature in the beta and nightly builds. This could change before the stable release, but right now, Brave is automatically enabling this feature. So if you dislike AMP pages and AMP versions of websites, then you don't have to do anything. You can leave this toggle on. However, if you are a fan of those type of slimmed down versions of websites and you are using the Brave browser, then you're going to want to go into the settings and disable this toggle. Now, the developers behind the Brave browser have many reasons as to why they dislike Google's AMP project with issues from privacy to security, and even just giving Google that type of power since this is a standard they have created. The folks behind Brave Browser are not a fan of Google's AMP initiative. I'll be including this blog post in the video description below so that you can visit it and read up on, again, their reasonings behind this change. And you can try out these features right now, again, in both the beta or the nightly builds of Brave Browser. And the company plans to push this feature to the stable build in the near future.